it's about culture, it's about wealth building, and I think we had a great time. My kids love history, especially wealth history. I'm glad of that. And so we learned a lot. I love to see like all the things, like how they decorate the bedrooms, um, why certain rooms were in the place. They had places for entertainment, places for network, the way they slept, places to write, journalize. I think that's really important. All the things that cause you to have wealth. mansion and we are doing a tour that I recommend my Women in Wealth Club do. We're um, doing it for Ryan's birthday because he loves museums and culture and history. So we're doing something that has to do with history of Florida, which is where we live. Watch your step. history room, which I love the concept. Come on, Women in Wealth Club members. Let's create history so much that you need a room for it. Theft and, uh, you know, being lost. And then of course we see silver. We've been telling our Women in Wealth Club, grab your silver, get your silver. And this has been valuable for years, guys. This is not new. This is why it's good to see this stuff. So that way you can know about wealth building. I like how the rooms were designed where you could access the room and the closet and the bathroom before you actually get into the entire room. So see the hallway and then everyone has a closet on one side and a bathroom on the other bedroom suite. This is beautiful. Why do we come and see things like this when they're wealth club? Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? We come because we want to get a vision of increase in wealth in your life. How things were and how they can be now. This is the morning room. The private escape. Little sitting room. The small private room created specifically for Mary Flagler. She retired to room to practice music and to write. We have witnessed history, we have witnessed wealth, and I love it because there are just certain things that were talked about in the home that we also share in Women in Wealth. Uh, things like silver. Uh, they had their silver and silverware on display. That was absolutely amazing to see because we know that um, this isn't something new that we do with collecting silver. This has been going on for years and ages and centuries and it's absolutely beautiful to see. We were able to witness a trust, um, a photo of a trust. That was absolutely amazing to see, knowing that 
building a trust can protect your family and your assets for generations to come. Um, what else did we see? Um, gifts from other families, wealthy families that they would gift um, people when they did extraordinary things. Also, how they would dine was life-changing and absolutely beautiful and etiquette and reminded me of Dr. Stacia. Um, you know, when I was younger, she put me in etiquette classes. And nowadays, you know, a lot of people, they don't do things like that. It's kind of something where we just eat our food and we go. But this is a great reminder of how coming together as a family helps you to build wealth and learn how to carry on that legacy. And that's what we're teaching in Women and Wealth. So if you can, if you're able to, if you're in Florida, come and visit the Flagler Museum. Um, if you have to travel here, put this on your list, put this on your manifestation list, because this is something to see. And I truly believe that when your mind is expanded, not just myself, but Dr. Stacia also, we believe that when your mind is expanded, when you see more, do more, uh, see how the wealthy live, it helps you to get uncomfortable and it helps you to be more profitable because once a mind is stretched, it can never go back. It's about legacy, it's about culture, it's about wealth building. And I think we had a great time. My kids love history, especially wealth history. I'm glad of that. And so we learned a lot. I love to see like all the things, like how they decorate the bedrooms, um, why certain rooms were in the place. They had places for entertainment places for network, the way they slept, places to write and journalize, I think that's really important, all the things that cause you to have wealth. And we teach that in the Women in Wealth Club. So it's not just a club where we help you build your portfolios, where we get you out of debt, and we help you create wealth legacy, but it's also about mindset. So it's about wealth accumulation and manifestation.